space to dream is a space where poetics in um, not chronological order and not hierarchical order is presented. The dream arises as something that's not in a chronological time. So if we think on a dream, we think of the time of the dream. Mm. And if we think of a dream, we think also that there are not hierarchies mm. in the dream. And we thought on this exhibition like that. Mm. And so the exhibition we've created to be seen as a whole, although there are a number of different themes that run through the whole exhibition. So we've designed it not to be a chronology, not to be by artist country or by a particular subject matter, but to pull out some of the rich experiences that artists are offering us, which relate to both their biographical circumstances and the broader context of the place that they're living in and the time, the time yeah. that they're living in. We could get different perspectives in how to introduce to audiences in New Zealand the art from this part of the world. So I think uh, what uh, Sarah uh, pointed out, the need to introduce main figures from South America uh, art uh, really helped me to understand better the situation and also enlightened me to do this direct research, bringing together these ideas. And always on the background, we would think how to connect with the audiences in New Zealand. That's, I think that was mm. important. So we hope that this exhibition has a number of different entry points. Of course, it encapsulates artists from seven different countries. Uh, by having selecting artists uh, from these countries, we didn't think like an Olympic, the mm. representation, but we thought always on artists and artworks and the thoughts behind that. There's some sense of memories that are being redrawn, those resurfaced again at times. But there's also a great deal of humour and positivity in works as well across, across the board. So the different themes that come out through the exhibition, such as revolution, memories, origins, cultural origins, but also the blending of different ethnicities which are touched on by different artists, through to the idea of new possibilities and new horizons, really can be found in a number of different artists' works and weave their way through the exhibition. And it's also important that we had in mind when we made this uh, curatorship is that uh, we really want families to engage. So I think although there are some very harsh and strong pieces, we have also that kind of humour and things for children, so it can be seen at different levels. Mm. Academics can come here, but also youngsters and children can have fun, I mean, or experience an activity. So that's very important. Mm. And I guess we hope that people take away that idea of a space of creativity that artists do create in our worlds for us, the space of possibility um, as well as some of the cultural history of the region, this very rich region of South America. Mm -hmm.